Hey guys, Wyatt Banks back here with another edition of the KSU ASI Headlines. We're gearing up for a busy week at the Stanley Stout Center. But before all that takes place, let's take a look at what happened around Weber and Call Halls during the month of February. The month kicked off with the 2022 Cattle Industry Convention and NCBA Trade Show in Houston, Texas, February 1st through the 3rd. The department had a booth in cooperation with K-State Master of Agribusiness, Kansas Department of Agriculture, Beef Improvement Federation, and U.S. Cattle Trace. It was a great opportunity to visit with ASI alumni and friends as well as visit with potential students. Congratulations to Dr. Dave Nichols. It was announced at the LPC luncheon during the Cattlemen Industry Convention and NCBA Trade Show that Dr. Dave Nichols has been selected as the recipient of the 2022 LPC Headliner Award. He will be formally honored at the 2022 Ag Media Summit in Raleigh, North Carolina, July 16th through the 20th. The 2022 KSU Swine Profitability Conference was hosted February 8th at the Stanley Stout Center. The event was attended by more than 150 swine producers, allied industry representatives, faculty, and students. Speakers highlighted the current status of the U.S. swine industry and growth opportunities in Kansas. The 2022 KSU Meat Judging Team won its second consecutive contest February 13th at the South Plains Contest hosted in Hereford, Texas. The team was high team in reasons, specifications, beef grading, total beef, beef judging, and lamb judging. Congratulations to KSU team member Ellie Kidwell, who was high individual overall. Congratulations to the 2022-2023 Henry C. Gardner Scholars. Since 2012, the Henry C. Gardner Scholarship application process has created an environment for qualified students to compete for elite undergrad scholarships. 33 students applied and represented the largest group of applicants to date. Academic standing, community service, work ethic, and future goals are taken into consideration. This year's winners were Sage Dirks of Douglas, Kansas, Lucas Dirks of Douglas, Kansas, Joshua Waller of Honey, Colorado, Chesney Effling of Highmore, South Dakota, Grace Nepp of Lincolnville, Kansas, and Riley Crable of Kingman, Kansas. The KSU Dairy Challenge team took first place at the Midwest Regional Dairy Challenge Contest held at Fort Wayne, Indiana, February 16th through the 18th. The event involves a team evaluation of dairy operation followed by a presentation of suggested areas of improvement. Evaluation includes production and financial records as well as facilities, procedures, and animals. It was a great weekend, February 18th through the 20th, celebrating 75 years of rodeo at K-State. 19 teams participated with 410 contestants. There was a sold-out crowd on Saturday night, with a total attendance of close to 10,000 people over four performances. Over 300 pounds of food was collected for the food bank from the Saturday afternoon Kids' Day performance, and close to $6,000 was raised on Friday's Cancer Night to help team member Taylor Widenhalf in her fight with lymphoma. Kenzie Jones was fifth in the average breakaway roping. Kylie Wynn was fourth in long round and sixth average goat tying. Sage Dirks was first in the long round, sixth in the average saddle brock riding. Sammy O'Day was 11th in barrels, and McKaylee Burkham was 13th in barrels. McKaylee Burkham, ASI student, was crowned Miss Rodeo K-State. The K-State Animal Sciences Academic Quadrathlon took place February 21st of the 24th. A total of 20 teams competed. Members of the champion team were Chance Copsa, Serena Scotanis, Scottney Reichenberger, and Jessica Smallfield. Each team participated in four events, laboratory practicum, written exam, oral presentation, and quiz bowl. The champion team will represent K-State in the Midwest Academic Quadrathlon Contest in March. The 2022 KSU Meat Judging Team won its third consecutive contest February 25th at the Iowa State Meat Judging Contest. The team was high team in reasons, placings, specifications, beef judging, pork judging, lamb judging, and processed meats. Congratulations to KSU team member Chesney Effling, who is high individual overall. Looking forward to March and April, we're excited to host these upcoming events on campus. We kick off March with the Stockman's Dinner on March 3rd. That night, we will be honoring Pat Coons as the 2022 Stockman of the Year. Cattlemen's Day and Legacy Bull Sale will follow on Friday, March 4th. You can still register for Cattlemen's at ksubeef.org. 
The 45th Annual Legacy Bull and Female Sale will be Friday, March 4th at 4 p.m. at the Stanley Stout Center. The offering includes 42 feed efficiency tested bulls, 15 fall bred cows, and 24 commercial heifers. You can visit asi.ksu.edu backslash bull sale for a catalog to watch videos of the offering. The sale will be broadcasted on CCI Live. Junior Beef Producer Day hosted by the K-State Youth Livestock Program is scheduled for Saturday, March 5th, and Junior Sheep Producer Day will be March 19th. Visit youthlivestock.ksu.edu for a schedule and registration details. Make plans to attend the 2022 Little American Royal on Saturday, April 9th during the All University Open House in Weber Arena starting at 12.30 p.m. with horses followed by beef, sheep, pigs, goats, and dairy. And that's another wrap on this month's edition of the KSU ASI Headlines. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Go download the KSU ASI app. We look forward to seeing you at both Cattlemen's Day and the Legacy Sale. Don't forget to bid high and bid often.